Hey ladies and gents, Rook here and welcome to Normal Films. Today we're going to continue our iTunes 12 tutorials and in this tutorial we're going to cover how to create a playlist within your iTunes library. For example, I'll just show you guys if you have the, it's a red icon, if your iTunes icon is red, that means you are running on iTunes 12 which and should be the latest version. You can um, check and make sure you have the latest version by going straight to the App Store and I'll go into your Updates tab to the far right hand corner and you'll be able to see if make sure you're fully up to date. Now, what we're going to do to create a playlist, first thing off, as soon as you launch iTunes, it will take you straight, most likely straight to your music or my music. We want to go to the playlist tab, just to the right of it. And then within the playlist tab, what we're going to do is we're going to go and we're going to go to File, New, at the very top, at the very top of our, um, not even in our iTunes library, but just the options at the very top, File, New, Playlist. At the same time, if you like command, command keys or quick keys, you can hit Command N and it will go to Playlist. From here, I'll create a playlist here, and I'll create it by by a default name, which is going to be just playlist. You can simply click on it once, right at the beginning of the name. Click on it once, and then change it to whatever you would like. I'll just do this one. I'm going to name it tutorial. And I hope I spelled that right. <laughs> but from here, the way you can add songs into your my tutorial is you can either yeah add it. You can add it from anywhere, from another playlist, for example. Then you can simply drag and drop it into that playlist or you can go straight into my music and let's say you find a song that you like here let's go to the rescue and their song the rescue and we can drag as soon as we start dragging it will bring up all our playlists that we have and we can drag it straight into that playlist by hitting by simply dragging and dropping into that playlist but in that be sure to give me let me know if you have any questions in the comment section below I'll be sure to get back to you guys as soon as possible and there you guys have it. We have our playlist tutorial and we have the song The Rescue that we just dragged and dropped into it. And other than that, also before I do leave, I do want to cover this as well. Um, if you go to new and then playlist, you can also create a smart playlist. And a smart playlist is basically like a recently added um, playlist here. As you can see, it has a gear next to it, meaning it's an edited playlist. And recently added, the way it's set up is any new song you add to your iTunes library, it will automatically be put into the recently added. Now you can do that's that's why it's considered a smart playlist because it's got specifics added to it. So we're gonna go create a smart playlist this time, and uh, match the following rule. For example, you can create rules for the playlist that way that song, whatever songs you want within that. Um, certain specific playlists. Let's say you only want songs that start with an A. All songs that want to start with an A, you can do that here, for example. And it's you just mess around with the settings here, for example, and it would be able to set it up. But I'll be sure I can make a further tutorial on this if you guys really want to know how to make a smart playlist. But other than that, thank you guys for watching, and later. Let my life be the proof, the proof of your love.